morning and welcome to the daily devotional for March 31st, 2023. Uh, taste and see that God is good. The more intimately you experience God, the more convinced you become of His goodness. God is the living one whose Lord is training you to find Him in each moment and to be a channel of His loving presence. Sometimes God's blessings come to you in mysterious ways through pain and trouble. At such times, you know the Lord's goodness only through your trust in God. Understanding will fail you, but trust will keep you close to God. Thank the Lord for the gift of His peace, a gift of such immense proportions that you cannot fathom its depth or breadth. When Christ the Lord appeared to His disciples after the resurrection, it was peace that Jesus Christ first communicated. Jesus the Lord knew this was their deepest need, to calm their fears and clear their minds. God also speaks peace to you, for the Lord knows your anxious thoughts. Listen to God, tune out other voices, so that you can hear God more clearly. God designed you to dwell in peace all day, every day. Draw near to the Lord and receive God's peace. Scripture Taste and see that the Lord is good. Blessed is the man who takes refuge in him. Psalm 34, verse 8. So he called, So she called the name of the Lord who spoke to her. You are God of seen, for she said, Truly, I have seen him who looks after me. Therefore the well was called Berhalaroi. It was between, lies between Kadesh and Barad. Genesis 16, verses 13 and 14. On the evening of that first day of the week, when the disciples were together, with the doors locked for fear of the Jews, Jesus came and stood among them and said, Peace be with you. John 20, verse 19. Let the peace of Christ rule in your hearts, since as members of one body you were called to peace, and be thankful. Colossians 3, verse 15. Prayer. Lord, thank you for designing me to dwell in peace all day, every day. Help me to tune out other voices so I can hear you more clearly to slow down, to sit in your presence, and to appreciate your blessings all around me. In Jesus' name, amen. And I hope everyone is having and has had a happy, healthy, and blessed week and weekend to come. God bless, keep the faith, and we'll talk to you again on Monday. Bye for now, folks.